Hey, what's up everybody? Today we're going to download and install Forge Universal for Minecraft. Um, a few things we want to do first is we're going to check the version of Minecraft that you're running. Uh, if, you need to do, if you need to update your Minecraft, you do it here. Click on Options and then click Forced Update. Okay, and that'll update Minecraft. In order to check the version that you're, you're currently using, you want to look here in the bottom, bottom left of the screen and see where it says Minecraft 1.4.2. That's the latest version. So make sure you're running the latest version of Minecraft. Next, we want to click on the Start menu. And in your search field, you want to type percent app data percent. And this will open up the Minecraft directory. Just select roaming. And here's your Minecraft directory here. It's dot Minecraft. Select your dot Minecraft folder, right click on it, select copy, and then paste a shortcut on the desktop. And this way you won't have to continue to type app data here in the search field. All right. So we've made a shortcut. We want to go ahead and click into that directory, go into your bin directory, and we're going to make a backup of this file here, Minecraft jar. So go ahead and copy it, copy that file, select the desktop, make a new folder called backup, and paste your jar file in there. And we can just move that off to the side. That's just in case we mess something up when we install this. Okay. You can minimize this folder for now. We'll come back to that. Another thing you're going to need is a compressor like WinRAR or WinZip something like that. I use WinRAR and I've put a link here in the description of the video down to download WinRAR. You'll see another link in the description and that's to download Forge. If you click that link you'll come to this page here. And if you scroll down a little bit uh, again you want the latest version of this and if you follow that link, you'll get the latest version. If you scroll down, you'll see where it says Downloads, AdFly, and Downloads Direct. You can click Downloads Direct. By clicking AdFly, you're supporting the developers. And typically I would use this one, but for this video, I want to show you how the AdFly works. And if we click it, uh, what we're looking for is up here in the right-hand corner where it says, Please wait a few seconds and skip ad shows up. Go ahead and click skip ad and your download window comes up. Okay, so go ahead and click that. Bring it down. We can close out of this for now. Okay. This is your mod. This is what you're looking for. This is what you want. So in order to get this working, we need to go back into the Minecraft directory. You can use the shortcut that we made or you can go down to the start menu and type in percent app data percent and it will bring you to this directory. Go ahead and go into your bin directory. Select your Minecraft jar file. Right click on it. Open with WinRAR Archiver. And just leave that open. Now go to your the file you just downloaded, Minecraft Forge Universal, and right click on that, open with WinRAR Archiver, and just get these windows side by side so that you can drag the contents of the zip folder that you just downloaded into your jar file. So I'm going to select this, hold down shift, which basically selects all and then I'm going to drag it over into this window. It's going to extract here and import here. Hit OK. Now what we want to do, and it's a critical step, your Minecraft will not work unless you do this step. And you need to find the meta-inf file and delete it. Just remove it and you can close these out. Okay? 
Now you want to run Minecraft and see if it runs. You want to test it. Hit log in as usual. You should see this window here. And as you can see on this, my version, everything's updated. The mods are there. You have the coder pack, the mod loader, and Minecraft Forge. Okay, so everything's installed correctly. Now, if you're having trouble with this, I've included a couple more links here. If you, if you install this file and you run Minecraft and it comes up with a black screen, you need to make sure you have these files in your lib directory. Okay, so find that shortcut again and go to your lib directory and put these files in your lib, just, just drop them in there and then run Minecraft again. And that's it. That's how you install Forge. All right. And if you want to install other mods, okay, now each mod is different. So each one is going to require a different set of instructions for this. Okay, I have some game mods here. Um, let's check this one out. Requires Minecraft Forge. So install that first. Copy all files into your Minecraft mods folder. Let's do that. Take these files, copy them, go to our bin, look for look for our mods folder here. There they are. Paste them in and you're good to go. So that's it. That's how you install Forge Universal. Send me your comments. Thanks for watching.